As soon as Avengers Infinity War dropped into theaters to shatter box office records and our expectations about the invincibility of superheroes, we've been craving more. Here's what we know about the untitled Avengers movie so far. This show contains spoilers from past Marvel movies, so don't say we didn't warn you. I'm going to allow that. No spoiler here, this cast is loaded with A-list talent. Joining Robert Downey Jr. as Iron Man, Chris Hemsworth as Thor, and Scarlett Johansson as Black Widow are a handful of familiar friends and foes, like Ruffalo, Cheadle, and Brolin. In September, Jeremy Renner, who was noticeably absent from Infinity War, posted this to Instagram to let the world know that Hawkeye was back in business. Executive producer Michael Grillo also confirmed that Tilda Swinton will be back as the Ancient One. The Untitled Avengers movie will also mark the last time Chris Evans suits up as Captain America. And is this possibly the last time that you're Captain America? It, it is. My, my contract is up. Evans announced in March that he was hanging up the shield once the film wrapped. The fourth installment of the franchise has added some fresh faces. Oscar winner Brie Larson, who landed the title role in the Captain Marvel film that will release just months earlier, will also bring her character's talents to the Avengers. In case you needed another reason to see the epic conclusion to the highest grossing superhero movie, Katherine Langford from 13 Reasons Why is on board. News of her casting broke in October, though her exact role has yet to be disclosed. A number of key characters are back from the dead. Despite dying in the opening minutes of Infinity War, Tom Hiddleston was spotted suiting up on set as Loki, and Idris Elba, Zoe Saldana, Tom Holland, and Benedict Cumberbatch are all slated to return. But how? These characters were either killed by Thanos partway through Infinity War or disintegrated at the end. Returning directors Joe and Anthony Russo have been notoriously tight-lipped about all facets of production. Remember this puzzling tweet on Rap Day? But that hasn't prevented a few clues from surfacing. Several cast members have also acknowledged the possibility of the quantum realm, an alternate dimension that would allow characters to reappear in different time periods. In a junket interview with Benedict Cumberbatch, Tom Holland conceded this. He has the most difficult huge. lines, though. Yeah. He has to talk about so much quantum realm stuff. stuff. But few MCU characters know the quantum realm better than Ant-Man's Dr. Pym. And it was Michael Douglas himself who said the quantum realm would be an important part of this chapter and all going forward. I had no idea that we were going to go to the quantum realm or disappear. Oh, yeah. So will the franchise resurrect its missing heroes to defeat Thanos once and for all? What the heck is this going to be called? And will the movie definitively end the third phase of the Marvel Universe, as reports have suggested? Only time will tell. Are you counting the seconds? So is Marvel, whose official site features this countdown leading up to the May 3rd, 2019 theatrical release. Don't want to wait that long? Hop on a flight to France or Italy to see it on April 24th. Or just, you know, travel through time. Everyone's doing it.